Hey guys, I know it's been an age again since I've made a video, but I'm making one now, so before I get onto the topic of my video, which is going to be um, what got me through everything over the last few years, I'm just going to do a quick update for everybody because I haven't been made a video in such a long time. So, first things first, I'm 18, woohoo! A lot of people have been asking on a lot of my um, older videos how old I am now and everything. Um, and some of the comments I don't think people realise, they don't look at the dates that I posted them and they don't realise that I made them like three years ago. So yeah, um, I'm 18 now, yay, which means I can drink legally and get tattoos, woo! Um, <laughs> but that's pretty much, otherwise it's exactly the same as it was before. Um, college. Um, I've been really stressed out with college recently, which is why I haven't made a video and, um, I know um, I've not replied to people's messages and comments as quick as I should do, but um, again that's just because I've been totally stressed and working non-stop on college work to meet deadlines and everything. And um, I did relapse with my anorexia recently, um, over I think it was over my 18th birthday, so in February sometime, February and early March, but um, I managed to get my eating back on track over the last three weeks or something. So yeah, that's better. Um, oh, another thing, if that incessant whirling sound or whatever that people complain on in my videos, it's my stupid laptop. Um, it doesn't shut up. I've tried, I've turned it off to let it cool down because I've been on it a bit tonight and it's still going. So please don't comment on that. I, there's nothing I can do about it. It's just annoying. Um, <laughs> so yeah. Um, I've probably forgotten things that I'll remember near the end of the video, so um, I'll do an update then. So, um, what got me through dealing with the sexual abuse, the anorexia, post-traumatic stress and self-harming and everything else? Um, well, Max is the answer, is my basic answer to that. I mean, friends and family have been a good help and everything and whatever, but my main the main thing that got me through was my dog max um many of you have seen the videos because i know that's all the only videos i have posted in the last few um months are videos of me um with tricks with max and things and buster but um yeah um it's some people like um ask well why you know why is your dog so amazing you know why would you pick him over people because i would i mean if anybody asked me to choose like oh him or your dog it would be my dog any day because he's just my baby um well and animals it's a funny it's hard to explain unless um you've got an animal yourself and got a dog um but max did save me he has saved my life and he's the reason i've recovered or in recovery and i wouldn't have been able to do it without him my parents bought Max for me when I was 16, um, just before I got admitted to the adolescent unit. Um, and I got admitted about um, a week or two after we got him. So he was only, you know, eight week old pup or whatever. And um, yeah, um, I got ill and lost weight and got admitted. And I absolutely hated it there, as I may have mentioned in my other videos. I screamed, I cried. Um, um, my mum came after I'd been in for three days and they brought Max with them and he was that excited to see me that he pulled the lead out of my mum's hand and ran across the um, unit's car park and fell at my feet and was crying and wagging his tail and licking me and was just oh it was just amazing and um, the one nurse said to me oh are you coming back in and I was like no no I'm going home going home to so I could you know walk Max and it's just I couldn't be in there without, you know, just realised that that moment that he was like my best friend and he was what was going to get me over this. So I did. I packed my bags and I discharged myself, which a lot of people at that time thought was the wrong thing for me to be doing. But I did it anyway. And for that first week I gained weight just so they couldn't section me and whatever. But um, I did relapse in like that first month and got threatened to be... Um, sent back against my will um, but because of Max 
I really, really tried and I avoided it. Now, there was times where I wanted to go and kill myself and things got too much and um, I used to run away, I used to go off in the woods and run off miles down into the village and wherever. But I took my dog with me, I took Max with me. And, yeah, that's my parents arriving home. Um, <laughs> and if I had Max with me, then they knew I'd be safe because I couldn't leave Max. As long as I had Max with me, by my side, I wasn't going to do anything stupid. Talk of the devil. Um, Max, come here. Max, come. Come here. Yeah, so as long as I had Max with me, they knew I wasn't going to do anything stupid and they didn't worry about me. They knew I was safe. So, if it wasn't for Max, I wouldn't be here right now. He's only small and fluffy and everything, and that was because I wasn't allowed a bigger dog in the house. I was never a fan of small dogs until I got Max. But yeah, um, I still have flashbacks of the abuse today and everything. But when I do, I just jump on my bed and Max comes and he jumps up beside me. And yeah, I just listen to music and cuddle Maxie. And everything feels better, doesn't he Maxie? So yeah, and he's a lovely dog. Say hi, Maxie. Look at the camera. <laughs> he's more interested in the fact that mum and dad have just arrived home, I think. But I mean, you know, he's pretty soppy. Maxie, kisses. He's like, no, I want to go see Buster. So yeah, um, I really would suggest that um, if you're having a rough time or you know struggling to deal with things that you would confide in an animal if it's a cat or a dog or I don't know because I talk to Max I pour my heart out to him I mean he can't answer which is probably a good thing but um yeah he is my best friend and my soulmate funny enough I have a boyfriend I'm perfectly happy with my boyfriend he's absolutely lovely but he knows that, that with me you get the dog and, you know, the dog was there first. So yeah, that is, that's the main way, really, I just wanted to say that's the reason I've got over everything I have is because of Max. And I wouldn't be here today if it wasn't for him. So, yeah. Right, things I might have forgotten. Um... I do do request videos, I've done a couple in the past, like the um, going to court, because some people wanted to know what going to court was like. Um, so yeah, if you've got any requests, please send them in. Oh, I've got Twitter now, I was bored the other night and I made it, so um, I'll put a link down in the description to my Twitter, or the, um, my name or whatever on Twitter. Um, I do add people on Facebook as long as you talk to me first and I kind of get a vague idea of who you are and like you're not some creepy stalker person. Um, so yeah, um, I think that's about it. Um, yeah, so if you need any advice, message me. Um, I will try and get back as soon as possible. I'm on half term now um, and of course we'll be starting a new project when I go back to college so I won't be as stressed for the first few weeks so yeah and thanks for everybody that subscribed and all the nice comments of course all the nasty comments boohoo go away you know whatever I'm not really fussed so um yeah nice to see everybody see ya